Hey everyone, it's Aneta with K-pop Oracles. I'm bringing you another K-pop tour reading. Today we're going to be doing a little friendship reading on Solar and Wean of Mamamoo. Okay, so let's get started. Let's see what is their connection like at the present moment. What is Solar and Wean's connection like? What is Solar and Wean's connection like at the present moment? We had the star. Huh, okay. So this is an indication that they might have gone through some ups and downs, okay? But they're they're healing for it. The car is a star uh, or sorry, this 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 the star card is it's all about healing from the tough times, seeing the light at the end of the tunnel, just staying optimistic or just hopeful for the future. So I think there might have been some like little little irritations, but uh, they they're getting through it. What is Solar and Lian's connection like at the present moment? We had the sun. Okay. Yeah, this is a, a card that it's telling me that they it's you know, in general this, there's a sense of happiness in the connection. I think that for the most part they um, get along. I, I think they they treat each other well. There might have been some things with the past in the past here with the star card, but um, just seems like they treat each other very well. Just seems seems like there's a lot of fun, happy moments. Both both positive cards. We have the emperor. Yes. Okay. Which is another indication that they've. Yeah, there's been there's been some tough times, but there's a return to order, so they're they're getting through it. They're um, there's I feel like they're very loyal to one another. I feel like they're honest with each other too, and I think that in some ways they're very protective of one another. The emperor is a very very strong, courageous person. He's very loyal and um, also offers security and like I guess to those he he's he's re like really close to. So I think there's a sense of yeah love between them. All right, so let's see, what does Solar think of Wien? What does Solar think of Wien? We had the Ten of Autumn. I think this is the Ten of Pentacles. Okay, so she thinks that Wien is basically like family to her, like just someone who is is just always, I guess, I, I guess like would bring anyone like a lot of joy and just cheerful. She's bright and just someone who is stable and has her stuff together. is is good with money and also I'm maybe she just sees that Wien is someone who you know loves her family a lot. It's just always maybe it's like a provider to her family or always. You know, helping out her family in some ways. So, uh, family means a lot to Wien, and also I think we sorry, Solar sees Wien as a like a family to her. What does Solar think of Wien? We had the ten of winter. Ten of winter. Yeah. So, I think she sees that like yeah, yeah. It's just like okay, this is a very tough energy. So the ten of winter is basically the ten of swords. So I think maybe she's she's um, sort of like Wien has gone through a lot. Wien has gone through so many hurdles. Maybe it's just like dealt with some endings of some sort. Not sure in which areas of her life, but. Um, Maybe it's just gone through so many ups and downs. Maybe there's some like joy, moments of joy or sadness, and and feelings of like disappointment. Um, but she sees that Wien is, is someone who's strong, like someone who can like set aside these issues and just move on, and or hope for like a you know a better future. It's like she's really resilient.
Oh my god, these cards. Stop falling over. Okay, with the solar, I think of Rian. We had the Queen of Autumn or Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, she thinks that Rian is the most sweetest person out there, okay? Like just someone who is very caring, very very creative and just like really loving and also just someone who's genuine like she's real like she's really authentic and just gives really great advice too like win is very wise and really intelligent and um she's like a motherly figure in some ways like she means well and i think she's she's always like looking out for others i feel okay What does Solar think of Wien? What does Solar think of Wien? We have Saturnus. Saturnus or Saturn. Yeah, the planet Saturn. Saturn is known, I think it's associated with, I would believe, Capricorn in, in, in astrology. So as to see, some ways she's like this Saturn Capricorn energy, like very down to earth, very humble, very hardworking, very serious when it comes to her career, like very, very focused, very determined individual. Okay, what else? What does Solar think of Wien? We had the Leo. Leo. Yeah, she's she's got this uh she sees that Wien has this very strong, courageous side and very charismatic, very influential too. Maybe also has a fun like extroverted side maybe like maybe she gives off like maybe her appearance kind of in general kind of gives you like i don't know like like an introverted character or, or maybe she looks like an introverted person or very like shy but in reality she's like very loud and extroverted and very social okay what else We have life energy and clarity. Yes, she's she's like the sun here. Is just it's just like the life of the party. Just someone who's full of energy. Just always happy, go lucky, very cheerful. Usually in a bright, always in a happy mood. Mm, what are you doing? Okay, we have danger warning and guidance, huh? Danger, warning, guidance. Okay, maybe what I'm getting here, okay, like Wien is just someone who is very cautious. Like she's maybe the type of person doesn't like to rock the boat or cause any issues or any upset or drama. And I also think that she knows how to address like difficult situations. Like she's able to offer any like advice or guidance or support. All right, let's see. What does Wien think of Solar? We have the Four of Cups, huh? Huh, okay, maybe like, okay, maybe Solar, she sees that Solar is someone who gets bored easily or it's just like, um, needs some, or, or needs some variety in her life, you know, needs some of that excitement, you know, it's just can't sit in, in one place for too long. She'll, she'll go, she'll get restless or, you know, really bored or tired. We have the King of Spears or King of Wands. She thinks that Solar is just, it's, it's a true talent, very artistic, really creative type. And also just someone, maybe like she sees that Solar is just someone who's not afraid of the spotlight, like loves being in like at the center of attention or, and, or just, you know, like uh, just someone who's, who's very courageous and very charismatic, like really stands out from the crowd. We had the two of coins. She thinks that Solar is a workaholic, like has difficulty like having like a work-life balance. Like she's she's constantly 
maybe she sees that Solar's con constantly taking on so many projects, doesn't have like much of a social life, uh, or you know, so or doesn't always have time for others, unfortunately. So she's always kept busy, always on the go. We have Aquarius. She's like this Aquarius, just someone who is who runs wild, runs free, you know, like just is unique. Maybe there's like a certain like I don't know, like she's she's yeah, I don't know how to describe it. I don't want to say weird or eccentric, but she, there's something about her that's very unique. <laughs> okay, very authentic. And also just really just a cool person in general. Like just she's very edgy, very cool. Like not afraid to try out new things. We have Capricorn, the boss. Yeah, she's like the a, like a true boss lady. Like she means business, very serious, like commands attention, like really ambitious too, and just someone who is like a true badass, like really accomplished in in her career, and just and also has a really down to earth side too. Like she's not, um, she's very humble. She's very, she's very kind. She's very like I don't <laughs> I don't know this like yeah. She's just very very giving, she's very, um, she's just someone who like, yeah, just like, is really good at what she does. Hi Mochi. We have right action. Yes. Okay. Okay. So. Okay. Right action. Okay. Like I think she's just someone who always means well. Like she's maybe she sees that Solar is just someone who, you know, w wouldn't do you dirty or like backstab you. Like she she would, you know, um, help out or just like whenever she can. It's like she wouldn't like you know betray someone or lie to you. She's always striving to do the right thing. We have your path, your path. Hmm. Okay. Maybe like she sees that Solar maybe sometimes has anxiety about the future. Like just really, maybe she's just unsure of what her true calling is or what her, what, you know, like what, like if she should like, you know, like what she should do in the future. Like maybe she's just unclear about her, her true path. Like, she just she sees that maybe solar has just so many fears or just anxiety or just um maybe like is not sure if music something is she wants to do long term like there's maybe there's so many things that she wants to to do before like you know she dies okay so let's see what's going to happen to their connection this year We have transformation, huh? Okay, so this can mean that there may be some changes in this connection. It just seems like it's, um, it seems like it's gonna really have a huge impact in their lives. It's gonna really change them. Uh, is it positive or negative? Time will tell. It's, so it seems like both both parties will undergo some sort of spiritual transformation. Something unexpected may happen. Okay, we have the five of water, five of cups, huh? All right, so, okay, so, okay, this is, okay, this is not the, okay, and then five of cups or five of waters tends to, it tends to have a bad reputation, okay, or, or tends to have negative means. It can mean, it can mean just feeling like, like left out sense of sadness or just always like focusing on a negative but there's always people like around you that who are willing to help you out so I think they might go through some hurdles 
they might experience some some you know sad moments together but I think they'll they'll have they have each other though they'll have each other and you know be able to kind of find some sort of light at the end of a tunnel had the ace of air ace of swords okay this is a card that represents new begin new beginnings kind of overcoming like obstacles okay and like work like it's it's a sign that whatever issues that may pop up this year like it, they'll be able to overcome it i think they'll kind of work together or communicate you know t like like with each other about how to tackle this issue and like try not to like get too overly emotional or too or let the emotions get in the way like they'll use their heads or their logic to kind of solve any issues. We have nurture, yes. Yeah, still, I feel like they'll, they'll continue being there for each other, continue like, I feel like they'll, yeah, care for one another, like, take you know like take care of each other making sure that you know both parties needs are being met nurturing each other we have flamingo spirit flamingo spirit all right so Right now, okay, there could be like an imbalance, but I think they'll be able to kind of like meet each other halfway or um, there'll be a sense of fairness like later on. We have Honeysuckle, yes, 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 yes. Okay, this is a card that represents happiness and affection. So this connection isn't gonna go anywhere. I think they, they'll still, their bond will continue to be strong. I just think that they might be have to deal with some kind of br brief sad moments with the Five of Water, Five of Cups here. It's gonna, it may have an impact on them with the transformation card. So, uh, but I think they'll, they'll continue to be there for one another. I think they'll continue to make time for one another as well, continue to care for each other till the end. So that's all I have for you. I hope you really enjoyed this reading. If you did, please remember to hit the like and subscribe button and follow me on Twitter at kpoporkos1 or Tumblr, kpoporkos.tumblr.com. Till next time, thanks for watching, bye.